So now that I've finished editing or creating my activity, I want to assign it to my students. So I'm going to click the green assign button. And so now I can choose what classes do I want to assign it to. So let's do this one and this one. And then I can edit what students it's assigned to. So I can differentiate. So I can, if I select here, I'm selecting all students. I suggest even if you're differentiating, always include your sample student because that allows you to kind of test things out. So let's say I'm assigning it to just those students. And then I can organize it in folders. So I can add folders here just by clicking on a new folder. So let's say math subtraction. Because I have a feeling subtraction is a large focus. So we'll do this blue. And then don't hit, oh, I'm creating a folder. Yep, good, okay. Then, so now it's tagged to this folder. And now I wanna click on skills. So I've already tagged it, remember when I created the activity, I saved myself some work. I've already tagged it to skills, but this is kind of like the second time around, in case I forgot one, I can tag it to another skill or add a new one. So I've got it in a folder. I have it to these students. I'm going to click the check mark to submit. I did that for my first group, so now I'm gonna do it for my last. So I'm going to have it assigned to all folder. Oop, I need to create a new one. So let's just do generic math. I'm creating, so that's why I'm hitting the green check box. Now it's in math. And then skills, remember, already saved myself work. Click the green check box. Now that I have differentiated and kind of stored and organized, always select the folder now. It just saves life later, trust me. Now I can click assign. If I click assign to two classes, it's immediately gonna be assigned to those students, meaning it will show up in their activities tab. Schedule, if you have Seesaw Plus or Seesaw for Schools, you can click schedule and you can kind of prepare it now, but it'll appear in their activities tab later. So I could say assign today and let's change it to five o'clock. And then once I'm ready, I just hit check. And now I scheduled, so now I'm going to assign. And notice it said at five o'clock. 